Good morning, this is Ray with OP Noobs covering E3 in Los Angeles 2017. I'm here with Joe Bognar, International PR Manager. Yes, correct. For Teclan Publishing, amazing studio, amazing games, high quality assets, attention to detail, evident throughout. Joe, thank you for joining us. Thank you. Thank you for having Thanks us Thanks for here. having me. <laughs> and behind us we've got Pure Farmland 2018. I did want to talk about the development of that and we were told earlier that it was initially Pure Farmland 2017, yeah. but you wanted to do it right. Uh, so basically what we've done, we've announced the, the game uh, during Gamescom uh, last year and um, we basically pulled the game back and we, we, we scoped the vision of the game. Uh, so because of that we are going to uh, now simultaneously release the game in Q1 2018. Uh, for PC, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. And uh, obviously, we've used the time really well. <laughs> As I said, we rescoped the whole thing. It shows. It shows we saw a demo earlier, and it's beautiful artwork, very, very good attention to detail. I did want to ask, from an industry perspective, when you talk about rescoping and pushing deadlines, that was that, how, was, how did that conversation play out? Well, it's probably... Uh, it was easier than you would think. Um, the idea was we, we are looking at uh, Pure Farming as uh, the first game in a franchise. So we want to make sure that we do things right. Uh, and uh, this is it. We just want to make sure that we do the best game that we can. Put your best foot forward. Exactly. <laughs> so you're putting your best foot forward in four different countries, four different continents to start. Exactly. You're doing Asia, Europe, South America, North America. That's correct. So, yeah. <laughs> well, please, could you tell us a little bit about that localization process? I saw some international assets, a Japanese text, in the game as well. So, basically, we're going to have uh, four locations. Uh, Montana, USA, um, uh, Italy, um, then, okay, I almost said the, <laughs> the other one, which we will have. Um, but uh, Japan, Germany, right? Japan and Germany is going to be one of the uh, DSCs that's going to come up. And... Um, Colombia. So you have different machines and different uh, crops uh, throughout uh, all of these different uh, locations. And um, yeah, so basically we just want to make sure that uh, the localization aspect of the, of the game, we want to make sure it's accessible to as many players uh, uh, all around the world uh, as possible. And uh, we will have the game coming out in a, a multitude of languages. What would you say was the most challenging aspect of, this, of the localization process? Well, it's obviously quite a specific uh, uh, language uh, that you have to use because yes. you, you obviously are using very specific uh, terminology, terminology yes. exactly. So, It's an attention to detail that Techland has throughout, so you want to use the right language. As I was telling you before, we want to make the best game possible, so uh, we may want to make sure that we are using the exact right terminology, right terminology and uh, we want to well, again, do the best what we can, yeah. And you have the rights to do that with the licensing, with the particular uh, real-world assets recreated in the game. Exactly. We're currently working on a number of licenses. We have a huge amount of licenses uh, already in the game. Uh, we're planning to go push until literally the day of release and even after that, especially with the, the machines and uh, especially with the activities as well and especially with the locations as well. And I did want to... <laughs> kind of end on that note because you've mentioned machines twice now. We talked about machines earlier. The players who play this game love the machines. They love the detail, these these ten ton beasts and the attention <laughs> to detail. And you couldn't have made this game ten years ago because Japanese rice planting machines didn't even exist back then. So how is that do you have a farmer who sits with a straw in his mouth in the office telling you how to do it? Basically yes. <laughs> no. What's his name? <laughs> <laughs> No, basically, um, the way that we, we look at this, uh, this whole process is that we, we know what the players want. We looked at the competition, we looked at the market, and we, we've seen that all the competition is doing a really good job in certain things. But what we're trying to do here is we, we're trying to pull all of this, these things together in one game. And uh, when we're talking about uh, rice planting machines, we want to make sure that, you know, if you're in Japan, you have to plant rice, right? So uh, we're, we're working with, uh, with all these partners and uh, trying to make sure that we have all the licenses that we need. I think the big takeaway here is that Techland Publishing listens to the gamers and they respect the gamers and they want to put, as you've, as you've said it several times, the best foot forward and the best product forward. This is a very exciting release for 2018. Do we have a time frame in 2018? It's uh, Q1 2018 for now. <laughs> Q1 2018, Joe Bogner with Techland Publishing. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.